another one goal loss, and there's been a string of them now, but if anything, you can see sort of the evolution of this team because you probably played the best team in the country tonight. Well, yeah, I mean, we played hard two nights ago. Uh, I look at, you know, we played 60 minutes of, of hockey tonight and 60 minutes last week tonight, and, uh, you know, they're a great team, and they put a lot of pressure on us at times, no question. Uh, but we stayed, uh, you know, pretty composed, and we played with a lot of energy both nights, and and, and, and gave them at least uh, the type of uh, of challenge that you know suggests that we're moving in the right direction. You know, we'll tell them, we'll know a little bit more next weekend. Let's talk about tonight. Opportunity for a point. First one, Paul Dayton. Uh, tremendous night for him again. Uh, I think of the second period breakaway save, Patch Oliver coming out from the, uh, the penalty box, and uh, he, he just gave you the opportunity to stay in this hockey game. Yeah, he's you know he's a, a, a veteran who's got the composure, uh, you know all those minutes and all the, you know saves and things that he's been able to do over the four years. You know, give him the confidence and experience to be able to come up big in the big moment. He certainly did tonight. The other opportunity for the point, and I know this kind of, it's kind of a double-edged sword, is your penalty kill was fantastic. But the problem is, is you don't want to spend all that time on the penalty kill. Well, that's part of it. You know, the struggle with our team is the discipline with the stick infractions. Too many little slashes, and you know, guys get a little bit leggy and they don't move their feet and you know, stay with people. Then you take a, a stick foul. And, you know, that's been a real Achilles heel for us. So, we, you know, we'll keep talking it and training it, and hopefully we, we all grow it in a hurry. Well, finally you got the uh, help you needed out of town with uh, both uh, Providence losing and Vermont. So now your focus goes to next weekend, two final games with Maine. Yeah, it comes right down to that. And uh, I didn't know about either of those games. Uh, didn't give them a thought, quite frankly. And, and uh, you know, that, that gives us, uh, you know, it's in our own hands, which is the way it should be. All right, too. Thanks very much.